Welcome back, friends. We are on Mars, heading into the, the mech facility that Hadrian is at to touch space. Our last episode, we did a mission for Ve Victus, Hadrian's father, clone donor. I don't know, whatever you want to call it. <laughs> um, so we're checking in with these folks first before we go hunt down. I believe it's the final member of the team. Captain, welcome back. I was afraid you might have gotten reassigned. You've been gone so long. So how's it feel to be a citizen? <laughs> I mean, that's true. I totally forgot about it. <laughs> Must have changed up how the ceremony works. I just raised my hand and said, sure, I'm in. But it is real good to have you here again. We've been going through the Terramorph data, and, well, we're gonna need all the help we can get. These logs, they're even more thorough than I remembered. Genetic workups, population statistics, hell, even their food chain. I'd completely forgotten, for example, that there was a creature that actually ate Terramorphs. What? <laughs> At this point, the data's given us more options to explore than we have people to work on them. That'd be something, wouldn't it? I'm sorry, are you? You're serious. You found our research team? That's incredible. That accelerates everything. With them back, it'll let us- oh, She's really excited about this. Kaiser, did you find Kaiser? <laughs> that, that's right. You would need that. Whoever gave you these leads sure knew their stuff. So how? How exactly did you manage to find them? I want to do that so bad. I wonder if I'll have another opportunity if I don't do it now. Let's, let's wait. <laughs> you can't be... Oh, you are serious. Okay. No more questions. Sorry. But still, getting Kaiser back, that gives us more than a few new paths forward on dealing with the Terramorphs. But if he's been out there on his own all this time, you're gonna need something. Come on. We've already made a lot of progress getting this place back online. Some of the containment chambers were a bit on the unpleasant side, but the facility staff made short work of that. I know it's here. Hey, I threw fun. that there a while back. Uh -huh. Here, Kaiser schematics. Actuators, weapons, batteries. That old robot's been MIA for a while, so it's a robot. Are, he's gonna need some repairs. Oh, he's my. also got a lock on his voice controls. You can give yourself authorization with the phrase "nos belli machinis." Now, where exactly is the old machine? I didn't catch that he was a robot, but I mean that's cool. <laughs> yeah, apparently that's the first I've heard of it. Mm-hmm. Military Model A. Customized them myself for when the Xeno Weapons team needed to make field runs. Part combat bot, part lab facility. Getting him back from wherever he may be will make our outside work a whole hell of a lot easier. A battlefield? On Nera? Ugh, oh, sheesh. No wonder no one's found him. That sector of Nera was destination number one for Xeno Weapons during the war. Add to that general environmental devastation and the kind of lawlessness that comes with any Free Star world, and that planet's got more than enough ways to make a visit your last. But I think there's a place where you can start your search. Hmm. Yep. One of a kind salvage. Licensed to an Angelo Alonso. Goes by gel. As good a place to start as any. 
Oh man, I got another opportunity. I don't know what to do. Um, I'm gonna wait. Surely it'll come up again. Surely it'll come up again, right? Right? Yeah, let's go with that. And I'll make sure we're ready to put them to use as soon as you've got them. I'll kick myself if it doesn't. Maybe I'll do it on camera for you guys to see. Okay. Now we're going to Nira. I love these thrusters. If you guys missed it, I learned how to use thrusters, really. How to unlock... And how to use them. You can almost turn on a dime. It is so great when you're in space battle. Oh. It does make it a little easier. I mean, let me rephrase that. It makes it a hell of a lot easier. So, I will reference it in a, a card at the top of the screen here. Uh, but yeah, definitely go check that out if you have not learned how to uh, use ship thrusters yet. It is so much better. So much. Sorry, okay, I'll quit screwing around now. Let's get to the plan. I like this ship. You know, the color has grown on me. I didn't like the color at first, but I do like the color now. It is very Captain Emily. Hello. unique. Hello there. Hey! New model on the floor. Welcome to the one of a kind. Refuge and rest home for the hardest scrappers anywhere. Name's Jill. Proprietor. So formal. The pleasure is all mine, my lady. Thank you. Angelo Alonzo, at your service. You can call me Jill. Can I get you started on a tab, then? Or are you here to try and make your fortune in the fields? I'm happy to take your credits however you want to hike them over. Kaiser? No bot around here with that tag. Oh, unless you mean Captain Ahab? At least, that's what we've all been calling him. No clue what his actual designation is. Since he's got some sort of security protocol that prevents inquiries and general chit-chat. Nice. But he's That's a combat him. bot, right? Yeah. That machine's been out there a while now. Hunting this one siren. The hell's a this siren? white whale. But it's been a while since anyone's laid eyes on Captain Ahab, though. Maybe he finally got the thing. Or it got him. Yeah, <laughs> I want to know what a siren is. Nasty kind of alien left behind after the colony war. Pretty much blind. Original ones brought to Nera were all Xeno weapons. But those critters have long since passed. But they left behind more than enough untrained babies to keep the fields plenty interesting. Okay, well, hmm. That's where I recognize that insignia. Red Devils. Yeah, Ahab's definitely your bot. So, sounds like you've got two options. You can wander around out there, hunting your bot, little old white whale of your very own. Maybe you find him. Maybe you get yourself killed. But knowing this rock is part of what we do here, so if you want to find him a whole lot faster, I'll sell you what I know about this. Kaiser's location. Going rate's a little steep, but I'm willing to negotiate. I'm listening. He seems nice, but he's very... Hmm. You know what? I like you. Maybe we can work something out. Yeah. 
In my experience, the right offer is always worth waiting for. Yeah, I hope so. It's so hard to know. Hold on. <laughs> I never said that was my final offer. Okay, okay, okay. You made your point. Yay. I'll give you a discount. All right, thank you. I mean, great for him, but that won't keep acetylene in our tanks. And honestly, would you be able to tell if a terramorph was attacking outside? Sorry. Pleasure doing business with you. So, last anyone heard of him, he was out near the Syracuse, shipwreck about a quarter click down the main strip. One of my roughnecks said he heard some kind of beacon. Just keep your ears open. You should find your machine. Eyes open, too. Sirens and ecliptic out there. Oh, great. And neither takes prisoners. Oh, and corpse retrieval is not included in this transaction, so now you know. Give Ahab a Kaiser, our best. All right. Well, I got a persuasion level, or a, not a level, but a point towards my next level up for persuasion. So that's cool. All right. This is our. Does it matter where we go in or come out? Should we search this place? I that something of value can come from those old mechs. What the hell just happened? Goodness. Look at all these mechs. I really want to see what this is. Warren's Galt. Oh shit! Okay, so that beeping noise must have been what I got on, um, oh, where I met Hadrian. <laughs> I work at IT, obviously, so maybe you might have caught that. I, I tried this on an iPad the other day, and <laughs> it couldn't get unlocked. <laughs> and it worked! <laughs> I'm so sorry! Go get a battery. All right, back to whence we came.
All right, Joe. Let's wait. Yeah, let's talk business. In need of materials, or just here to have a drink and enjoy the views? All legal. I... <laughs> All legal. I swear. <laughs> Listen here. Damn. Let me see if I can, like... Ah, so that's where your machine's been. Ran out of juice. Heat leeches, wasn't it? Those little stowaways are everywhere on this rock. Suck the power out of a pen light if you let them. But a micro cell. That's military-grade tech. I think we might have one, but I can promise you it's not going to be cheap. You could probably Frankenstein one together using our fabrication system here, but only if you had some quality schematics. Let me guess, you have those for sale? So, I just brace for a little sticker shock. Okay, so I cannot craft these yet. I have not put any skill into research. Methods, which I believe is what's needed. Whatever else you find in those spots, you sell. No better selection. On so I'm just gonna have to buy the darn battery, which really sucks because it's expensive. Oh well, is what it is. All right, my friend, I have a battery. battery accepted. Operational power levels restored. Analyzing. Residual damage detected. Impact shielding. Visual systems. Damage within acceptable limits. Thank you for your aid. I must resume my mission. Please step aside. Weapon disarmament. High risk. So I will ask you to stand aside. Major Sanon. We'll have to wait. My god. I cannot leave my mission. Although, previous attempts to disarm the weapon have been unsuccessful. Additional support may allow me to complete my active mission more quickly, allowing me to leave this place. What weapon is this? Request denied. My current mission requires completion. Will you provide support? My mission is the disarmament of Unit XW-99. Designation, Siren. Nearest final active Xeno weapon, 99, has proven a far more formidable adversary than its peers. Will okay. With disarmament. During the colony war, handling of Unit 99 and its peers were among my personal duties. Deploy Unit 99. Defend Unit 99 against hostile forces. But above all, Ensure Unit 99 was never used against non-combatants. When I was separated from the Xeno Warfare team with the Armistice, Unit 99 and its broodmates remained here, causing many non-combatant deaths. So I am here to correct my mistake. I have nearly succeeded in disarming their brood. Only Unit 99 remains. Follow me. Good, he walks faster than a person. Initiating I can't see. Let's, uh... Let's mow him down. 
Got my lawnmower. Good lord. I think I need to save that for... <laughs> oh my god. Oh yeah. It looks like it's hazardous to you as well. What is it that is said about one man's junk? There is so much junk. It is difficult to recall how that goes. I believe, my dear, it's one man's junk. It's another man's treasure. I am detecting Unit 99. But there is a complication. What? What is the complication? Unit 99 is on the other side of that reach. But it appears to be under the control of hostile forces. Sensor suggests Ecliptic, a mercenary company like Ecliptic, would only want Unit 99 to utilize it as a weapon. This means Unit 99 must be disarmed immediately. Standard procedure would be a frontal assault on the outpost. No quarter given. Do you concur? No. Very well. I will wait for your return. Simple and straightforward. A good choice. Moving out. Oh, jeez. Shit. Always work 
checking. Never know what you might find in their pockets. Okay, that was, it really wasn't too bad. Model as we have in the Army First Class and will respond to any threat on the station. I don't have any clearance to know what goes on here, but I know well enough that any security breach needs to be eliminated. Given the stakes, I've made it my personal project to bolster their weapon systems and studying their, their call stacks. I feel like I can make some improvements in the programming subroutines too. But when I told the lieutenant, she responded that the, the, with grim. I'm sorry, she responded with that grim stare of hers. She reminded me that I need to get approval through the proper channels before modding the machines in my own. All right. I don't know if I need any of that, but I got it. Alright, you. We did your mission. Now come do mine. Work here is finished. Now, what is this mission you spoke of? Major Sanon is involved. Yep. A plague of Terrahorf attacks. That is disconcerting you are docked at one of a kind i will meet you there awesome where's my girlfriend i have no idea where she's at come on vasco we got we got party coming Let's get out of this crazy planet. I don't know why they want to live there, but I don't work there. My friends, we have retrieved Kaiser, who turned out to be a robot, which is pretty cool. Uh, we helped him get his, you know, a new battery back into his system because he was sucked dry by the heat leeches. Yes. Um, so we, we brought him back here to Mars. We're going to call this episode a rep and continue the next one on the rest of this mission. Uh, I hope you're all still with me. And if you are, feel free to like and subscribe. Leave me comments. Let me know what you'd like to see more of or even less of. And I uh, hope you come back for more. You guys have a wonderful evening. Thank you. Goodbye.